Now, Lewis, I don't know if you remember, but back in 2011, in April of 2011, we talked about a doctor at a weight loss clinic in Pennsylvania who was being arraigned because he was clearly lying to women and he was sexually assaulting them. And he was saying that if they had orgasms, it would help them burn calories. And then he would say that he would be able to help them by having sex with them, so on and so forth. And he would use electronic massagers to, quote, break up the fat. Now, I thought that was one of the craziest stories related to uh, men using as a cover something medical or or otherwise uh, a necessary treatment or or procedure to really just be able to be sexually in contact with women. But now out of China, we have an even crazier story. Uh, this is out of Guangzhou and a man who claims to be a Taoist priest defrauded a woman of 20,000 yuan after convincing her to have sex with him to, quote, exercise demons. This is being reported by Shenzhen Media Group. And according to police, a man surnamed Huang visited a feng shui store and he struck up a conversation with the sales assistant. And they uh, he did like a little bit of a cold reading on her to kind of convince her that he was like some kind of psychic. And then he said, listen, I'm actually a master dragon seeker and I'm able to help you. And uh, uh, she confessed that she had love for an older man. And basically the idea was, listen, you have demons and I can fix the demons. So they went through this huge process, Lewis, of re uh, renting a hotel room and then getting the woman to dress in lingerie, which would supposedly allow this expert Huang to be able to see where the demons were. And Lewis, no surprise, it turns out the demons were in her vagina and the guy was able to use his penis to remove them. Quite a businessman, isn't he? Yeah, not only did not in, only did he pull that off, but he managed to get a, a large sum of money out of it. Too. That's right. He was paid to remove vaginal demons from a woman with his penis. It's pretty incredible. And when he was arrested, he says, I didn't have sex with her. We Taoist priests are not allowed to do such things. If you don't believe me, we can get a doctor to check. I have very severe diabetes and have long been impotent. I'm also almost blind. And um, when he was asked for information about these exorcisms or sexorcisms, as they may be colloquially known, Huang said that, listen, there are just some things that metaphysics and science cannot explain. I think that this guy is obviously a dangerous predator, but at the same time, what type of person would believe this type of thing? We have to be speaking of someone who certainly is either very, very sheltered and has such total lack of resources that they don't recognize that this makes absolutely no sense or or this guy is just incredibly good at manipulating people. I just can't understand how the, how someone even believes this. Usually people like this are, are, are masters at finding the most vulnerable people and right. capitalizing on that. Yeah.